All right, guys, today I'm doing an unboxing for you guys. Um, I got this at a really good deal. Uh, this is the Acer Chromebook 11, and um, it uses a Chrome OS. And um, why I chose uh, to get one of these is uh, because it's uh, supposedly it maintains its speed regardless on how long you've had it for. So, um, and I'm going to do a comparison video. I'm going to do a full review on this, uh, but this is just the unboxing and. Um, because I have some, I have a Surface. This is a Surface Pro, um, and I've had this for a while, so I'm gonna, I can do a full comparison for you guys. This one has Windows 10 in it, um, so I'll compare how good they both are. So uh, here's the side of the box here, and if you guys can read that, but it, this is the specs. Okay, so it's got Chrome OS, it's got an Intel Celeron N2830, 11.6 uh, LCD. Intel HD graphics, 2 gigs of memory, uh, EMMC 16 gigs, which is basically your SSD drive, um, 802.11ac, and of course a webcam and 3 cell lithium ion battery. This, uh, I believe, has about 10 hours of battery life. So, 10 or to 13 hours of battery life. Uh, and this was a demo model, um, that's why I got a good deal on it. So. Let's open this up. So this is what is inside. So when you open it up, you got this. So here is the system itself. Here are the cords. Okay, so the cords are white. Okay. Um, here's your little AC adapter. Here's the white cord to attach it. And this cloth bag feels pretty nice. And of course you come with some, I don't know, some guide of some sort. And of course a quick start setup guide. So that's pretty much it. Okay, so here is the what you guys have been waiting for, the Chromebook itself. That cloth bag is nice. But this is what it feels, look at this, this thing is so thin. The profile on this is actually quite nice, um, and it, it's very sturdy. Like, you, it's so a lot of uh, students get these Chromebooks because they're nice and portable. They weigh next to nothing, and they are durable. So, uh, and the battery life on these things are pretty phenomenal. Uh, so there's a USB 3.0, an SD micro SD, uh, sorry, an SD card slot right there, a headphone jack, and a USB 2.0 port. Kensington lock, and of course your HDMI out, and of course a, the AC charger. So those are your ports. Here is what the screen and bezel look like. Like I said, I will be doing a full review of this. And that is it starting up. Look at that. Look, look how fast that boots up. I just, I didn't even turn it on. It just... So that is why people get Chromebooks. Because they're super fast at booting up and everything. So. Uh, that's the screen. It's got a pretty good viewing angle. Um, well, for a t I think it's a TN, uh, TN display. So, uh, but it doesn't seem to be. So there's your viewing angles, guys. Um, so stay tuned. I'll be doing a full review of this. So here's some more quick specs, just in case you guys want to see. And all right, and the keyboard feels pretty nice. So oh, and the buttons are different because it's a different OS. So. Uh, other than that, it's pretty cool. Uh, stay tuned for a full review, guys. If you have any questions, comments, post them below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel.